In this video, I will be going over the installation of MySQL Workbench on a Mac or on a Windows machine. While I am demonstrating the installation of MySQL Workbench on a Macintosh, I will also discuss the installation process as we are talking through the installation of a Mac about the details of the installation process on a Windows machine. To start off with, we need to go to a website, so open up a web browser and type into the URL http colon forward slash forward slash www.mysql.org. Once you come to mysql.org, you will notice a couple of tabs over here mysql.com, downloads, documentation, developer zone. So you are going to be clicking on the downloads tab. Under the downloads tab, if you scroll to the bottom, you should notice MySQL Community Edition. Feel free to click on that. Now we're going to be installing MySQL Workbench and so you want to scroll down to MySQL Workbench and select MySQL Workbench. Now, before we go ahead and install, uh, before we go ahead and download and install MySQL Workbench, a couple of things to point out for Windows users. If you are running MySQL Workbench on a Windows machine, you need to have the following two libraries installed. If you don't have them installed, please go ahead and install them. If you're not sure whether you have them installed, please go ahead and install them. They are the Microsoft.NET Framework 4.5 and Visual C++ Redistributable for Visual Studio 2015. Please download both these libraries and install them on your Windows machine. Now, if you are installing MySQL Workbench on a Mac, please make sure that you have the latest version of Mac OS. If you have a previous version of Mac OS and you are looking for a previous version of MySQL Workbench, you can click on this link for previous versions and you can select the version that you want. I'd recommend you install the latest version uh, if possible, if not, roll back to a previous version. In this case, I'm going to look and install the latest version. I'm going to download the Mac OS X x86 64-bit DMG archive. If you are working on a Windows machine, please download the MSI installer. You can download the MSI installer if you are working on a Windows machine. You are presented with the screen. You do not have to log in or sign up for an Oracle web account. You can just click on no thanks to start my download. This is going to take a few seconds. Once the download is completed on a Windows machine, feel free to browse to where you have downloaded the file and double click on the MSI file. On a Mac, double click or actually single click on the DMG file. As you can see, the DMG archive is opening up. Once the DMG archive is opened up, it'll present you with this. On a Windows machine, feel free to go through the installation process by clicking the next bus button. Feel free to use the defaults that are present. On a Mac, what you might want to do is drag and drop the MySQL Workbench software into where you would like it installed, in this case, my Applications folder.
In this case, I already had my SQL Workbench present in my Applications folder. I'm just reinstalling it or recopying it over the older version of my SQL Workbench. On a Windows machine, please feel free to click Next, use the defaults, and proceed through the installation process. Once the installation is completed, you will find MySQL Workbench under on your Mac menu, under where you have installed it. On a Windows machine, you should find it in your Start menu. Thank you very much. Please write to me if you have any questions.